Hey there, YouTube fans. Hello, it's Jeremy Mansfield here. I am just going to be talking to you about, like, my plans that I have for my YouTube channel. Um, I know this will be kind of a late upload, but then, obviously, the next day you can watch this. And this is what I plan for. Um, it may not happen, like, perfectly, because everyone's not perfect in, in every way. But this is what I plan to do with my YouTube channel. I don't know if I will be able to follow this um, day for day and stuff like that. But like what my plan is to have like a daily vlog uploaded at least. Um, so that way you have something to watch every day. Like whether it be just mis miscellaneous stuff that I talk about or like other topics and so on and so forth. Um, but as of right now, I know, like, on my channel, there has been, like, uh, like, MTG Arena. I've kind of put a halt on that right now. I'm trying to figure out a situ uh, situation because, like, with the, the software that I use only allows a certain time limit. And so maybe the fact of um, I upgrade it and then it'll allow me to do unlimited time so that way you could see the whole game because what it's um, timed at is like 15 minutes and obviously uh, some games last longer than others. And with the whole step of you showing the beginning of the video and talking a little bit and then pressing and then waiting for an opponent and the steps like beforehand before you get into the game could just be like cost of like the extra time so i've kind of put a hold on that but i also may uh just change that video until i do find something for it is that i just talk about mtg arena like whether it be cards or just in general um the new sets and how like maybe a format that either I play or I just like research about and just talk about that within that um, playlist and whatnot. Cause like, yeah, I put out the MTG, like the beginning of the arena and stuff. And so like, obviously it's a good, it's a good thing to play. Um, obviously I recommend you try it out sometime cause it's really fun on your computer if you can. I know sometimes it, it takes a lot of space or if you're using, like if you're watching like on a school computer and you can't download it, then that, that's un understandable. Um, also, what I also plan on doing um, as of right now, I've also created like gaming contents as of you've seen that I've done Warzone episode one and two, that's me playing Warzone. That was two video clips. I kind of just try and keep it short and sweet but obviously that one got a little bit lengthy with those two i try to keep maybe a 20 to 25 minute limit um depending on but yet also like throughout the videos i also talk commentate and also uh, give out a message of try to stay positive i know it sucks right now with this quarantine like yeah it could be repetitive but sometimes people just need that um reassurance of okay try to stay positive, just try to keep chugging along. Eventually we'll get together and all that stuff. That's what kind of what my uh, motivation for this channel to be is just try to stay positive as much as possible. Yeah, we're in hard times right now with everybody keeps saying, we'll get through this together and everything will be all right. Um, also with the stuff behind me, like I uh, will, could possibly do a video on like all the memorabilia within my family of collecting um, with all that stuff going around too. Um, I also plan on doing like a woodworking vlog too, but also like on my other like, vlog, blog, whatever, uh, on my channel is uh, every like Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. Maybe it might be that. It's like an every other day thing where Saturday and Sunday it gives me a break that I can just do a blog, vlog, I mean, a vlog, and then just post it and then be like done. Because I kind of create these like as the days go on. I don't kind of like re, uh, like, do a few vlogs and then post them. I kind of do a day-to-day, -day, like an actual, like, 
because I may do like how I'm feeling personally or whatnot and just do like day to day because then it gives me something where if I record a few and then upload them, then it's like I really don't have like something to look forward and then it, I just may like be stale or whatnot within my videos and you possibly may, obviously you're going to be seeing this uh, same scenery behind me because this is the best lighting and stuff because if I was in my other spot, it, it kind of got a little dark and I kind of don't want that. I want to have a light, lightness in my videos. Um, I also, within my videos, like to say authentic, like, yeah, like people could be like uh, trimming it and cutting it to like highlights and stuff. But it also, um, it also could be like nice to see like the whole process of like the game and whatnot. Like, yeah, it could be a little lengthy, but yet also, um, you could see what I could be like an actual like gamer like yeah I'm gonna be trying to do my best and uh, become the best that I can be within the series of games that um, whether it be Madden I possibly maybe do a MLB one yeah I have 2018 it's not the latest game how like more uh, YouTubers have 20 um, I have 18, so, like, obviously I don't have the latest, but I can still have fun and try and do the best that I can with the game that I have. Um, I'm trying to process with, like, Fortnite stuff, um, trying to look into it and all that stuff, because um, when I was doing, like, Madden, I was uploading them, and then I realized that I had music into it, and I don't want copyright strikes or whatnot onto my channel. So luckily it gave me an opportunity to change it because I put it on private and I didn't put it on public right away. So um, obviously I'm just trying to look into like just cutting out like music and stuff, having it authentic of just me. And obviously with, it'll, it'll probably allow me to have in-game like in-game commentary and all that crowd noise inside the game. But I also just wanna protect myself from getting those uh, strikes because I don't want to post something that will get me in trouble, which is what I don't want. Um, also like maybe do like real life uh, stuff like if maybe on my phone or whatnot or if I were to uh, buy a camera or whatnot of what I'm doing like day to day, um, how my life is too. Um, I could possibly do that like after this is done and all that fun stuff, but I don't know that for sure. Um, it just comes and goes, but as of right now, as we're stuck inside, like I'll try to do a vlog every day. Um, live streams are coming soon. I just got the camera today, thanks to a family member that ran, uh, got it for me, my uh, sister. Um, she, she's she been helping us. Uh, she doesn't live inside this house. Um, which is um, obviously sad because you don't get to see that person day to day, but yet also um, we get to see her like when she drops stuff off and helps us in a way um, since we're, we are trying to stay quarantined and she's one of like uh, occup assistant occupational therapists and works with like kids and stuff. So she's out and about obviously risking her life online and all that stuff. Um, and so she's doing that great stuff for us, which is cool. And um, more videos will come as I make them. I'll try to stay to a stick schedule. Obviously, things change uh, day to day because I'm also still in school. I need to finish off strong. So assignments may take longer than others. And so therefore, maybe I may not be able to do a vlog every day. Um, because of my school schedule right now until like the first or second week of May, depending on what my um, teachers are doing. Because some of them are, hey, have a big project of the first week of May. And then that last week is your like final week of either catch up to um, turn in like late work or whatnot, which um, I don't have a problem of having. And um just doing that and then having our big 
uh, final project on the first week of May, and then we're done with the school year. And then obviously you do the course reflections of all universities. They do that um, just trying to make sure that the employees are reliable and what they're doing is good and um, they're real feedback because some of the instructors that I've had within the past are like, give me real feedback because yeah, they may be a good teacher, but yet also they like to know if they need to be better at things because like any athlete or anything, like you strive to be better every single time. And yet if they have a th uh, system that is working and students are uh, going well in what their system is, then obviously like say if, okay, you don't need anything to change or if they need a like little tweak here and there, hey, can you do like more of, can you be um, more specific on the terms or give more real life examples? Cause like um, some teachers can do that. Other teachers um, may be a struggle with that and just let them know and all that fun stuff. And so, um, yeah, so I'll try to keep, like I keep saying is, try to keep the schedule of maybe posting a vlog every single day. It may be late, um, cause I got obviously a life um, besides this and with living at my parents' room and I try to make it um, where like there's less noise around and uh, yeah, and just willing to have fun and also comment down below of what kind of series would you want if it's gaming or uh, let me know if whatever um, is within my vlogs, um, what kind of ideas you would want. I also probably, um, since the draft of the NFL draft has been done, that uh, maybe tomorrow I'll do that um, of reviewing of what the Packers I'm personally just going to do the Packers because obviously I'm a, I'm a fan of the Packers. I'm a fan of all teams, but if I were to pick one team, I'd pick the Packers and see what kind of uh, draft um, reaction that I will give to that. I've looked at them, um, but obviously I'm not going to give you my reaction now because it'll be in the next video. And so um, hopefully you're staying safe, staying positive. Um, I know this sucks. We've been here for a month and a half. Um, soon to come that eventually it'll slowly come back together. Obviously in Wisconsin, we're trying to get it back slowly. Um, I don't know about any other states, but if you're watching this from a different state, hopefully your, uh, your state gets back together slowly but surely. Um, it's kind of tough. You don't know what's going to happen. The coronavirus is undetermined of how it's going to spread because you may have a system uh, symptom that you can't really see. And so um, everything is just up in the air at this point. And we obviously all of us just want to get back at it of what we we're doing. But we also know that we may put other people at risk and it can be very dangerous at this point. And we're doing very good right now. And we just need to keep going strong and just keep working at it. And eventually we'll get back together soon and hopefully you have a great rest of your day and peace out.